I'm back with another video, but today is going to be about natural dreadlock hair. So before we get into the video, please like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. So I wanted to talk about a topic feed that I actually created on a group page in Facebook. Um, it's called Lady Lock Matter. And I created a feed saying, what if your spouse wants you to cut your hair, your natural, beautiful locks? And I tell you, <laughs> the internet always wins. When it becomes like a controversial topic, people go in on it. But if it's positive, sometimes, you know, people, they shy from it. But that's okay. People like what they like. So can you believe this post right here got a thousand comments and I just was just trying to create a post to see what kind of energy people were going to give out. What advice they would do if they were in relationship with someone, would they cut their hair for their spouse? What would they do in this position? So as I review over this, a lot of people were like, oh no, don't cut your hair. Divorce him if you're married to him or break up with him if you're with a long-term relationship with this person, just forget about that person. If they want to change you, divorce them, break up with them. Like, I could not believe that was like the number one comment on this post. It's amazing at the rate that like marriages, like people really break up or divorce over the smallest things. Because like, you know what dreads, you can, basically write it down and put a wig on and do a sewing if you want to like that's like the easiest thing so my thing is if you're in a relationship with someone and they give you their opinion of what they like you should probably compromise on it to be quite honest like it usually works out so it's just a lot of negative stuff on this post like i'm looking at it like people are like oh that's someone that they're messing with. Like, people love to start drama. Like, the internet, like, they will say, oh, forget that person. Like, they go straight to that instead of having an actual legitimate solution. So if you are a person that has dreads and your spouse says, I like this, you know, like, it's not a big deal to switch it up every now and then. You know, you don't have to cut your hair. You don't at all. So I would say if you're in a serious relationship, it's always best to compromise and understand the person. And communication is key. Like, it's great that your spouse says, hey, I like something a little bit different. You know, like, they, it's not all about your hair. You know, you can switch up your wardrobe for them. Like, if you're wanting to be with someone for a long period of time, the same look kind of gets old. Sometimes it does. But be appreciative that they're voicing their opinion to you and saying, hey, I like this. Because in all actuality, you know, some relationships go the other way. The people run to someone else or whatever the case may be. I don't want to get into that. But it's like in this post, they're like, oh, oh, that person's doing this, doing that. But they don't really know, you know, so... If you like posts like this, let me know. And I will just talk to you about relationships, advice, and things like that. If you want to talk to someone about your situation, you know, I would be more than happy to discuss it. Again, if you have a topic you want me to talk about, I would be happy to make a video on it. Until next time, bye.